Check it here, bring you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we have a special one for you. We are going to be analyzing and discussing this picture that our light has placed into the uh, Boom Beach Discord server earlier today. What it could mean for Boom Beach and uh, everything like that. So, before we get into that, big shout, Operation Hit of the Day is going to go to our newest member, guys. This guy's name is Capone. And he's been pretty fantastic uh, so far, so we gotta give the man a big shout out. Um, he opened up Boomtown for us, and it was literally just like it was just textbook, like it was just perfect. Like the guy just doesn't make mistakes. He's is he's just unreal. So it, just watch this. He he's got Everspark. He's got the Scorchers up. He loses a couple Zookas there, but keep in mind this is with all the bugs that I'm not even gonna get into right now because there's so many of them. I kind of touched on them yesterday, but from what I have seen, the main problem. If you're wondering why you're losing a bunch of attacks lately, there's some sort of uh, splash damage defense radius bug that's causing extra damage from laser beams, it's causing uh, extra damage from machine guns. I don't know if it's necessarily damage or just the fact that it shoots things more or faster or something, but machine guns, absolutely lethal right now, um, which we'll probably be able to see in uh, today's Dr. Terrence, guys. But, uh, but yeah, I wanted to give a big shout out to Capone and talk a little bit about the bugs. Now let's get into the fun stuff, guys. So we're going to be taking on Dr. Terrence. You guessed it, guys. You guessed it. Dr. Terrence with the new hero, Private Bullet. And we've... I, I feel like we got to get some good attacks with the taunt first before we can really move on to anything else. So, today let's... Um, We'll mess around a bit with all of them and see if we can find any use for the, the shock knuckles mainly. But, um, yeah, I wanted to talk about this image. So, you might be thinking, chicken, it's just a picture of him sitting there. Be, um, be a little bit more um, eyes open, guys. So, what do we have here? It looks like there's something on his wall. And it says, crab, mega crab, cancelled. So... It looks like we're not actually getting a Mega Crab, guys. And you see we've got these words on the, on the wall here. Crystal, Res, Remote, Mini, something, Crystal, Cryo, Super, Speed, Turret, um, 800, and then 900. So, interesting stuff, guys. Interesting stuff. So, obviously, there's not going to be a Mega Crab. But I think what we can confirm from this, like, if it's not obvious enough from the picture, guys, Obviously, the Mega Walrus is finally coming to Boom Beach. Everyone has been highly anticipating this. And I am glad to bring you guys the information first that uh, it looks like the Mega Walrus is, is all but confirmed at this point. So um, let's go ahead and see if we can get a uh, bullet to run up in front of the Zookas here. And we'll go something like this. We'll go bang, bang, bang. And we'll get bullet to come up like that. Then move the Zookas down like this. And then we'll taunt him like this. We trapped a couple of the girls onto Bullet, but that should be okay. And we'll see how this works. So I'm going to heal up these ones. And then everything is going to shoot at Bullet. And it kind of worked. You want to get them farther away than that, but um, it, it kind of worked, guys. So there's stage one. Let's do one more. Let's get at least one good attack with each ability and before we... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Before we get uh, too crazy into this. So I've been... I've been really struggling with the map clears lately, guys, and that is, uh, I'm 100% blaming that on all the bugs. It's not the chicken skill whatsoever, that could never be the case. Um, but yeah, we had a really nasty operation, uh, the last operation. Uh, and we're also gonna be blaming that on the bugs, so it's never, it's never your fault, guys, it's always the bugs' fault, so just keep that in mind if you're having bad attacks. Just blame it on something else, I do this all the time, like, in everything in life in general, like, just blame somebody else. Always good advice with the chicken, guys. Always good advice with the chicken. So, we'll get a shock going up here. We'll flare the Zookas way back over here like this. Even farther, why not? And then we'll get the taunt ability going up like that. Now, you want to make sure when you're doing this... See how the shock expires? You, you want to make sure that the shock goes down. You want to make sure you shock bullet, and then you're smoking right afterwards. If you shock bullet, and then wait a bit, then... This, then what's going to happen is the shock's going to run up while the smoke is still down, and then he's going to charge back over towards the Zookas. So, um, definitely don't do that. Let's try it one more time. Let's try it one more time. I know it doesn't really count on any of these stages because they're so easy, but um, I feel like we did a really bad job showing him off yesterday. So, we're going to try to clean that up a little bit here, guys. Um, it's going to be harder to do on a uh, on a shorter base. Oh, big shout-out to Commenter of the Day, Shan S. Um... Basically saying, Chicken, why don't you just uh, shock bullet before, um, instead of trying to do all these fancy uh, bullet attacks. 
And yeah, that's uh, that makes a lot of sense. So maybe we'll try that out. We'll flare the Zookas back like this. And then we'll flare onto the HQ. Now we're starting to get the hang of things, guys. We're going to throw some critters down here to distract this one lone sniper tower. Just so there's no uh, possible way of, uh, of anything happening there. So... Uh, what happened there was the, the mortar targeted the critters, so I shouldn't have thrown the critters there because the cyber tower had like zero health left. Um, but so far, so good. So far, so good. On Volcano Dr. Terrence, of all Dr. Terrence's guys. Um, okay, so we'll, we'll try this one more time. I know I keep saying we're going to switch them all, but it doesn't seem to be happening for some reason. Um, okay, so we'll go like this. We'll take out these guys. We'll take out the shock launcher. We'll take out um, some more mines. We might as well get the shock launcher right out of there. Um, okay, so we'll go like this, launch all the smokes down, and they should sit in that smoke onto that machine gun. We might have to re-smoke here, but since we have the GBE tribe boosted, uh, we should be alright. So, next we're going to go right about here. Actually, I want to go right over here. Um, okay, so they should go in roughly the same path. Roughly, guys, roughly. And then we're going to go bang, bang, bang. And then we're going to shock bullet way over there. And then we're going to get the Zookas up right about here. And this seems to be working a little bit better, guys. Now we have to be careful of these machine guns. Okay, so we'll go like this. Uh, the rocket is on the same side as the Zookas, so it was going to target uh, us there. But everything else, everything else targeting bullet, guys. So very advanced bullet strategies. We'll throw an artillery on them just to celebrate. It's not going to make it there in time, but there's stage four, and uh, it's going a little bit better. It's going a little bit better, we got to say. So, uh, all right, so stage five, we'll dive on into, and, okay, interesting stage five, guys. So, I'm, I feel like, I feel like flaring him past the HQ makes it a lot easier, but the whole trick is just to get him out in front. Just get him walking, get him moving, get him sprinting. See, here's another bug, guys. There's the, the smoke. We, we discussed this on the live stream. I don't want to get into the bugs too much, just in case people watch these videos way later. Um, then it won't be relevant at all. But there's a lot of bugs. Hopefully they'll be fixed soon. Um, it is very annoying because I was actually like really unimpressed with it the other day because I was trying... Um, uh, hold on here, guys. I was trying to clear my map and it was just freaking impossible. Like, the bases were so much harder. Uh, so we'll go like this... Bang, bang, and we should be able to distract, uh, nothing? Okay, interesting. So, even though, even though we had, uh, we had the taunt going off, <laughs> if you have a shock launcher, two shock launchers, rocket launchers, and machine guns, especially machine guns right now, shooting at you from behind, then it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter where your taunt goes. So, um, that's enough of the taunt ability, I guess. I, I feel like we've we've tested that one as much as we can. Tested, used, whatever. Um, so let's use the uh, let's use the iron knuckles and the warriors next, and see how this plays out, guys. So we'll get the warriors loaded up, and we'll get the shock knuckles with private bullet also loaded up. So let's try to see what happens here. So another bug that we're gonna see right now is the the artillery doesn't clear three mines. Also kind of annoying, but. I don't know, it is what it is for right now. So, he actually moves pretty okay with Warriors. You'll see here, he does stay pretty tight. Because um, he's not like, because he has melee uh, distance, right? So, we'll go like this. And then we'll go bang, bang. Because his melee, um, he has melee range, right? So, he's not like Brick where he's going to stand like 10 feet back. But, um, we'll get the Shock Knuckles going off here in a second. And see how this is going to play out, guys. Now, I've been hearing people say... So look at this, look at this. We shocked everything behind with the shock knuckles. And uh, I've been hearing people say that um, warriors seem to be bugged as well. I'm not sure if that's uh, specifically to warriors or if it's just, again, the splash damage, uh, everything kind of being affected by that. Um, but yeah, this is great. Lots of stuff going on. Uh, even though there's bugs and, and the bugs are annoying. Um, still, we, we got the update. We got a... Uh, Hopefully, uh, the uh, I mean the the Mega Walrus uh, confirmed to be coming 100% uh, is also very nice, guys. Um, I'm not sure where to come at this from. This is kind of an ugly. This is gonna be an ugly walk, guys. So strap yourselves in. It's gonna be a gross one. We'll get uh, bullet loaded up, and let's march them right about here. Something like this. 
Now, flaring warriors to an area with bullet, not a good idea. Because he's not going to be able to keep up with them um, as well as some other heroes would be. So then we'll go right about here. And then we'll, we'll milk kit through all of the uh, mines there. Which is going to be good. Bullet's going to come up. And then we're going to go right over like this. And I mean, from what we've seen here, bullet doesn't really work that badly with warriors. Now, the problem... You have to get him on the opposite side of all the stuff you want shock. You see right here, he's going to get the shock knuckles off. Or not, because he's going to get shocked. But if he had got the shock knuckles off, you see what would have happened was... He wouldn't have shocked anything. There's nothing behind the HQ. You see, he shocked the mortar in the sniper tower. That actually kind of worked out well, the way, the, the way he was standing. Because the shock launcher was hitting him instead of directly hitting the warriors. So, like, only half the warriors were clipped instead of, like, all of them. Um, alright, we gotta speed this up here, guys. This is gonna be a long one. Um, alright, so stage 7, with the Shock Knuckles and the Warriors, guys. Shock Knuckles and the Warriors on stage 7. Let's dive in and see what we can get done. So, uh, we'll go ahead, launch all the troops out like this, flare them right onto this boom cannon, just like that. We'll let Bullet catch up. Bullet with the Shock Knuckles, interesting. I, I didn't think this was gonna be, uh, this was gonna be that good, so... We'll get the uh, smokes going like this. Again, we're going at this from the wrong side. Um, bullets, shock knuckles aren't really going to do much of anything here. But we'll use it uh, for the sake of using it, I guess. So we want to shock. One, two, three, and four. And then we'll get a health kit down like this, guys. And bullet has been shocked by the chicken shock this time. So we shocked bullet before he could shock the HQ. We get one off, but I mean, he shocks stuff that we already shocked. So, stage 7 goes down. Back, 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 back. So, that's going to wrap up the video today, guys. Make sure to let me know down below in the comments what you think of this picture. Uh, Mega Crab is cancelled, but don't worry. Obviously, we can see by our light socks that uh, the Mega Walrus is clearly confirmed. That's going to wrap up the video today, guys. Make sure to leave a like if you're interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you in the next one, guys. Check it out.